Esport is competitive gaming. Many high schools have teams, colleges have scholarships, and the sport is rising in popularity quickly. League of Legends is one of the most popular esports games. This year, more people tuned in to watch the League of Legends World Championship game than Super Bowl 50 when the Chiefs took on the 49ers. I don't think adults really realize how big it is. It's a multi-billion dollar industry. Adam Jasensky is the director of technology for the Afton School District. Two years ago, the high school started an esports club with five students. Last year, that group grew to 30 and became an official esports team. We competed with other schools throughout the kind of central region of the U.S. and actually made it into the playoffs in several games. There's been so much interest in the esport team. This year, the district hired an official head coach. Meet Sam Barker. It's definitely been something I've been interested in for a while, watching it. Um, I've never played competitively myself, but I've been playing you know, video games for a long time. And I've definitely been interested in the esports and how it's growing academically. Sam and Adam both say that esports are a way to engage students who aren't necessarily involved in other sports programs and give them a sense of camaraderie. The games we play, um, even though they're on a computer, they still have the same levels of sportsmanship that you know your football programs or um, basketball programs would have. Still teamwork and strategy. Strategy is huge in esports, and there are also other skills that students build that they can take outside of gaming. Those critical thinking skills are definitely going to be developed. Um, and then being under pressure and having to make decisions, the kids are going to be doing that every time they play one of these games. And if a student wants to take gaming past high school, over 150 colleges have esports teams. Maryville has a very successful esports team. They have a huge program and have been incredibly successful. Most colleges now have college level esports teams and actively recruit um, high school students and offer scholarships. The Esport Missouri League that Afton will be competing in starts next month. Reporting, I'm Katherine Hessel.